Today the topic which I'm gonna share with you people is, ketogenic diet, in which we talk about the keto basic, different types of ketogenic diets, ketosis, diet for diabetes and pre-diabetes. If you want to maintain your health stay in shape then keep watching this video till end. If you like this video give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel, keep your notification on. What is ketogenic diet? The ketogenic diet is a very low carb, high fat diet that shares many similarities with the Atkins and low carb diets. It involves drastically reducing carbohydrate intake and replacing it with fat. This reduction in carbs puts your body into a metabolic state called ketosis. When this happens, your body becomes incredibly efficient at burning fat for energy. It also turns fat into ketones in the liver, which can supply energy for the brain. Ketogenic diets can cause significant reductions in blood sugar and insulin levels. This, along with the increased ketones, has some health benefits. Different types of ketogenic diets. There are several versions of the ketogenic diet, including Standard Ketogenic Diet SKD. This is a very low-carb, moderate protein and high-fat diet. It typically contains 70% fat, 20% protein, and only 10% carbs, 9 trusted source. Cyclical Ketogenic Diet CKD. This diet involves periods of higher carb refeeds, such as 5 ketogenic days followed by 2 high carb days. Targeted Ketogenic Diet TKD. This diet allows you to add carbs around workouts. High Protein Ketogenic Diet. This is similar to a standard ketogenic diet, but includes more protein. The ratio is often 60% fat, 35% protein, and 5% carbs. However, only the standard and high-protein ketogenic diets have been studied extensively. Cyclical or targeted ketogenic diets are more advanced methods and primarily used by bodybuilders or athletes. What is ketosis? Ketosis is a metabolic state in which your body uses fat for fuel instead of carbs. It occurs when you significantly reduce your consumption of carbohydrates, limiting your body's supply of glucose sugar, which is the main source of energy for the cells. Following a ketogenic diet is the most effective way to enter ketosis. Generally, this involves limiting carb consumption to around 20 to 50 grams per day and filling up on fats, such as meat, fish, eggs, nuts, and healthy oils. It's also important to moderate your protein consumption. This is because protein can be converted into glucose if consumed in high amounts, which may slow your transition into ketosis. Certain symptoms may also indicate that you've entered ketosis, including increased thirst, dry mouth, frequent urination, and decreased hunger or appetite. Ketogenic diets can help you lose weight. A ketogenic diet is an effective way to lose weight and lower risk factors for disease. In fact, research shows that the ketogenic diet may be as effective for weight loss as a low-fat diet. What's more, the diet is so filling that you can lose weight without counting calories or tracking your food intake. One review of 13 studies found that following a very low-carb, ketogenic diet was slightly more effective for long-term weight loss than a low-fat diet. People who followed the keto diet lost an average of 2 pounds more than the group that followed a low-fat diet. What's more, it also led to reductions in diastolic blood pressure and triglyceride levels. Another study in 34 older adults found that those who followed a ketogenic diet for 8 weeks lost nearly 5 times as much total body fat as those who followed a low-fat diet. The increased ketones, lower blood sugar levels, and improved insulin sensitivity may also play a key role. Ketogenic diets for diabetes and prediabetes. Diabetes is characterized by changes in metabolism, high blood sugar, and impaired insulin function. The ketogenic diet can help you lose excess fat, which is closely linked to type 2 diabetes, prediabetes, and metabolic syndrome. One older study found that the ketogenic diet improved insulin sensitivity by a whopping 75%. A small study in women with type 2 diabetes also found that following a ketogenic diet for 90 days significantly reduced levels of hemoglobin A1c, which is a measure of long-term blood sugar management. Another study in 349 people with type 2 diabetes found that those who followed a ketogenic diet lost an average of 26.2 pounds .9 kilograms, over a two-year period. This is an important benefit when considering the link between weight and type 2 diabetes. Other Health Benefits of Keto 
The ketogenic diet actually originated as a tool for treating neurological diseases such as epilepsy. Studies have now shown that the diet can have benefits for a wide variety of different health conditions. Heart disease. The ketogenic diet can help improve risk factors like body fat, HDL, good cholesterol levels, blood pressure, and blood sugar. Cancer. The diet is currently being explored as an additional treatment for cancer, because it may help slow tumor growth. Alzheimer's disease. The keto diet may help reduce symptoms of Alzheimer's disease and slow its progression. Epilepsy. Research has shown that the ketogenic diet can cause significant reductions in seizures in epileptic children. Parkinson's disease. Although more research is needed, one study found that the diet helped improve symptoms of Parkinson's disease. Polycystic ovary syndrome. The ketogenic diet can help reduce insulin levels, which may play a key role in polycystic ovary syndrome. Brain injuries. Some research suggests that the diet could improve outcomes of traumatic brain injuries.